the swallowtail. December had embraced the land with solemn arms of clay, no swallowtail to cheer the frozen meadow with its play. The lupin and the lady's slipper lost in deep repose, likewise the singing cricket where the morning glory rose. Oh, where the song of summer the meadow did lament, the fledgling and the swallowtail, the lavender's sweet scent. Oh, where the kids of April, the downy winds of June, the bleeding lamb held to my breast beneath the swollen moon. Gone into the stillness, the cold north wind replied. Gone into December's quick embrace, the mistral cried. I took a frozen spruce in from the cold to cheer my night. Adorned the boughs with candles to give the pagans light. The branches warmed, had soon performed a curtsy and a sigh, while bowing low the forest soul was sent a mile high. When at last the spruce was cheerful and pleased to share its light, I spied a glint of yellow emerging in the night. Upon a limb of needles, pristine and whole and free, a newly wakened swallowtail began to speak to me. Oh, do not mourn the swallowtail, the cricket, and the rose. Do not lament the sun's descent when cold the north wind blows. For deep December's bluster has hidden us from sight. But you shall see, Persephone will free us from this night. For spring will follow winter, as dawn will follow night. And we are always close at hand. We keep you in our sight. All through the merry season did the swallowtail abide. A yellow hint of sunshine when the night was cold outside. But as the days grow longer and the warming spring draws nigh, oft I catch a glint of yellow in the corner 